All right, what's up, homies? In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to overclock your controller. When you plug in your controller to a PC, you're gonna get about five milliseconds of delay, but if you use this method, you can get five down to one millisecond, which is gonna improve your gameplay. I recently just went to a LAN, and this is the exact method I used at that PC, and it's also the one I've used on my own personal PC. So you guys will see at the top of the description, there is a link, click that, and it will bring you to this page. You're going to click on HID USB F, it should be the third one down. Click on that and then you're gonna click download. Once that's downloaded, you're gonna open it up. Bring that over here for you guys. So when you open that up, it's gonna look something like this. Next, you gotta extract all for this folder. Once you extract it, you're gonna go into driver and then click setup. And it should pop up something like this. What you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna go up to the top left, click on this, go from mice to all, and you should be able to find your controller. Right now I'm using a Xbox Elite controller. You'll see it's for default no, and that will be switched by the end of this process. So what you do is you click on the device, click install service, open. Then you're going to go to default 1000, install service, open. And then finally filter on device, install service, open. So what this is going to do is you'll see it's for 1000, yes. What you do is you unplug your controller, plug it back in, and it should be at one 1000 yes and now after all of that your controller is overclocked anyways if you guys enjoyed this short tutorial make sure to leave a like and i'll catch y'all tomorrow deuces